Hello and welcome. I'm George Crump, lead analyst with Storage Switzerland. Uh, today we're going to continue our uh, test drives of the various uh, products from the Drobo company. Uh, we've, as you know, had the Drobo Elite in the lab for quite some time. We had the Drobo Pro FS in the lab and we're getting ready to do some reporting on that and the uh, guys at Drobo uh, updated the product to a new version so we're really excited to test that it's called the Drobo B800 FS the B stands for business so this is a business class device uh, and one of the neat things is I think about the uh, Drobo products is the ability to if you will upgrade and so what we're gonna do today is we are going to move uh, the data that's already in our, or the drives that are already in our Drobo Pro FS into this new unit. Uh, and I think one of the biggest challenges isn't, necess isn't necessarily getting new systems, it's how do you get the data over to the new systems. Well, with the uh, Drobo products, that's actually quite easy to do. Uh, as you can see on the screen here, we've got about a terabyte and a half in use. We've got about almost three terabytes uh, available in free space. The um, what's interesting about that if I had to copy that one and a half terabytes off of there and onto a new system, uh, I think we could all agree that would take a little while. So what we're going to do though is take advantage of a uh, feature within the Beyond Raid product that allows us to uh, just move drives over. Uh, and so I was wondering how I would show you that because the other neat thing is that you can you don't necessarily have to get the drives in the right order. So what we're going to do is, you can see here, this is the configuration of the uh, Drobo Pro FS right now. Uh, and I've got the first three drives are two terabyte drives. The last drive is a one terabyte drive. So what we're going to do is when we uh, get the new unit plugged in, we'll come back in. We'll tell you about how that went. And we'll go ahead and plug in these drives, uh, but we'll do so in a different order. We'll put the... Uh, one terabyte drive maybe in slot two and, and uh, move things around a little. Well, maybe we'll put the one terabyte drive in slot one because, you know, those guys at Drobo could be doing something tricky with the first drive. So we'll try to make sure we really mess them up. Uh, so anyways, uh, tune back in here in a few minutes and uh, we will uh, update you on the progress. Thank you. I'm George Crump, lead analyst with Storage Switzerland.